In this video, we will learn about quadrilaterals. So first of all, we should know the meaning of the word quadrilateral. Quad means four. Lateral means sides. So quadrilateral is a figure which has exactly four sides and we can see that this is a quadrilateral, it has four sides. Let's see some real life examples of quadrilaterals. Here we have a kite. We can see that the shape of the kite here forms a quadrilateral. It has exactly four sides. So this is a quadrilateral. Similarly, we can see the tiles on the floor. So this pattern which is being formed here, it also has four sides. So this also is a quadrilateral because it has exactly four sides. We can take one more example. In this pattern, we can see that this pattern is a trapezium. It has four sides and this side is parallel to this side. So this is a trapezium as one pair of opposite sides is parallel. And in the grills, we can see that this is also a quadrilateral and this we can see is a rectangle. One more example of quadrilaterals we can see in the map of Chandigarh. So in the map of Chandigarh, the sectors are in the shape of quadrilaterals. So this is one sector and we can see that it is in the shape of the quadrilateral and we can see other sectors also in the shape of the quadrilateral. Chandigarh is a very well planned city. That is why all the sectors look in the shape of quadrilaterals here. Now let's discuss properties of quadrilaterals. Quadrilateral is a plain closed figure bounded by four straight lines forming four sides. We have adjacent and opposite sides in quadrilaterals. So for example in quadrilateral ABCD, AB and AD are the adjacent sides. Similarly, BC and CD are the adjacent sides. Opposite sides can be AB and DC. Similarly, BC and AD are also the opposite sides. Then we have quadrilateral PQRS. This is slightly tricky. Here adjacent sides will be PS and SR and PQ and QR. These can be the adjacent sides. And opposite sides can be PS and QR and similarly PQ and SR can be the other pair of opposite sides. In quadrilaterals we have four vertices so we can see in both quadrilaterals ABCD and PQRS we have four vertices and there are four angles in a quadrilateral. So here in this quadrilateral, we can easily identify the four angles and it is slightly tricky here. In this quadrilateral, the four angles are this is the third angle here and the fourth angle is this angle. Then we can identify the opposite angles. In this quadrilateral, angles A and C are opposite angles and angles B and D form the other pair. And in this quadrilateral, opposite angles are angle P and angle R and the other pair is angle S and angle Q. Similarly, we can have consecutive angles, angle A and angle D, angle D and angle C, angle C and angle B and angle B and angle A are consecutive angles. Similarly in quadrilateral PQRS, angle P and angle Q, angle Q and angle R, angle R and angle S, 
angle S and angle P form consecutive angles. Then we can have the diagonals. In quadrilateral ABCD, the diagonals are AC and BD, both are inside the quadrilateral. And in quadrilateral PQRS, diagonals are SQ and PR and PR being outside the quadrilateral. Now let's discuss some non-examples of quadrilaterals. So this is not a quadrilateral because this is not a closed figure. Here we do not have a closed space bounded by four straight lines. So that is why this is not a quadrilateral. Here AB is not a straight line. That is why this is not a quadrilateral. And here all the four sides do not lie in the same plane. That is why this is not a quadrilateral. Let's summarize the key learnings of this video. Quadrilateral is a closed plane figure bounded by four line segments. We learnt about examples of quadrilaterals and properties of quadrilaterals. We also learnt about non-examples of quadrilaterals.